Well, today is the day we are selling another car. We're selling a car that has probably gained majority of my following in the past year and it sucks, but it's gonna be okay. And that car is Monica. We finally have found a buyer for the gray M4. And honestly, it's kind of a relief because we have had this car for a while now. And ever since I decided to keep the yellow car, I've been still making payments on this. I owe a good amount of money. And once we sell this thing, we won't have any debt. That's crazy. I'm gonna have two crazy cars, the Corvette and the yellow M4 and no loan. Someone, one of you guys actually, found a buyer for Monica. So we are actually taking a risk today though because we are driving all the way to Seattle, which is four and a half, five hours from my house and delivering this car to the buyer. That means that we don't have a ride home. But I gave the keys to the yellow M4 to Jean because we are actually getting a special mod for the yellow M4 if the sale goes through. Now I say if because a lot of people will hand deliver cars and then the buyer won't show up or they'll flake or they'll decide they don't want the car. Now let's go ahead and drive this car all the way to Seattle, show the buyer the car. It's gonna be dirty because, well, all the bugs and everything, but I think they'll understand. Man, I really hope this deal goes through because if it does, the yellow M4 is gonna be insane tonight. Like literally, if this goes through tonight, you guys are gonna be seeing a completely different yellow M4. I'm so hyped. And then, once we sell this car, we don't have to say yellow M4, gray M4 because we only have one M4 on the channel. <laughs> well, there it is. It's a 2015 BMW M4. <sighs> 60 to 130 in 11 seconds. What the f is that? Could've been your lip. Oh, it was just the J-Pipe, thank God. GE37s, baby. So we are six minutes from his bank and he is already there waiting for us. Let's hope he likes the car. It's really dirty. You can see all the bugs we killed on the way here, but interior, I detail that pretty nicely. So let's meet this guy, show him everything about Monica, and then hopefully we'll be carless in about two hours. All right, we are currently in the Starbucks restroom because their music is very loud, but the car sold, it's gone. Hands are clean, we have no debt. That's crazy. But anyways, so we're waiting for Jean. Jean's coming over, he has the M4. He's gonna be about three hours, and then after he comes here, we're gonna pick up the special part for that car since we got some extra cash now. Okay, he's here. What are you doing? Okay, no, 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 no. I need to go to the bathroom like right now. I'm gonna piss in your seat. All right, stop here. Stop here and hop in the Starbucks. Oh, I'm gonna piss myself. Get used to the front end because in about two hours, it's going to change completely. <laughs> oh, How are you? You're so f***ing cool. <laughs> what? It pops and the door doesn't open? <laughs> oh my Get God. in the car. Who is this guy? I like the, I like the um, Nerf gun on the front seat. Nice oh, touch. Yeah, yeah. Never know when you're gonna, you know. It's a good thing it's not a real gun. Yeah, no, uh, no. The the new Nerf guns they make are actually they pretty, look really realistic, really realistic, especially when you take off the orange tip. Oh yeah, no, I think that might be illegal actually. <laughs> Holy, f that was the longest piss up in my life. In T minus 13 minutes, we're gonna be picking up one of the best mods for the F80. Love go. 
goes women buddy buddy like it's been that when I'm looking at the bill stack off the bubbly buddy I was that's right boys we got GTS hood we sold the car and got a hood now this is actually paint matched on both sides we don't know if it's full aluminum or carbon one side and aluminum the other but let me show you the bottom of it so the bottom side's fully paint matched. He kind of hit it here and here, but it's not a big deal. I kind of want to replace this with a carbon vent at some point, but you can see how it's two pieces, and I think that's like FRP and on your side's carbon, but I was on a paint match anyway, so I didn't really care. But this is my little reward for selling the gray car. Oh, it looks so good. Now the plan was initially this weekend to install the icons, and I actually have them right here but i decided if something goes wrong we are five hours from home and we wouldn't have headlights anymore so kind of a risk so i think we're just going to do that when we get back home but right now we are out of meat we have a bunch of really sick cars there's a bunch on the other side too taking pictures and then jean and i are going to be going to fd later and that's going to be fun you ready for fd FD in a little bit. FD is nuts. FD, you're nuts. But dang, I wasn't sold on it, and there is still a little bit more tweaking we have to do. There's like a hundred different points of adjustments for these hoods. So like right here, this gap, I want to actually make it a little bit smaller. And then on the other side too, the gap is just a tad too much than what I want it to be. I want it to be a little bit more flush. So we'll adjust a little bit more of it, but for now, it looks pretty sick. At least it fits the front bumper nicely, which is the main part that I was concerned about. And the paint match is pretty good. It is a fresh paint match though, so I don't know, it could fade a little bit more. It is a little tad more green, but this part is also PPF too, so PPF kind of changes the color a bit. But yeah, super stoked. Traded my stock hood for this, so we can't go back, boys. That was such a good idea to get it. Do you think you think it was a good idea? Hmm? What's yeah. your opinion on yeah. it? Yeah. 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 Of course. Of course. Of course. Great. Great choice. You know what? You technically could have stolen my car and registered it in your name and I could never have done anything. Because the title and bill of sale were in the glove box. We're registering the minute we get home, but... Why would I do that, though? I don't know. Because you're just here for clout. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, check out this new cam. Listen. Look, it's like staying right in between one yeah, no, and like it's, one, it's moving. 115. Look at that. Get the gauge. Get That's the gauge. a crazy <laughs> cam. Bro, it's like a high performance cam. we're doing right now to this car is completely changing the whole like demeanor of it bro like the minute we put the headlights on it's gonna be like the most menacing f80 around well i decided to trade spots with jean so now he's got to get the seat all where he wants it to be damn son why you back so far it's for uh so like do a pull, mm -hmm. it doesn't like pull you back, it pulls you down. Oh, you know? so it's like I can't even see it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, pretty good. Just like that. All right, you got the maps. Let's get going. All right, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get right into his window, like get a little bit farther up. Oh, he definitely gonna rev it. All right, now rev it. <laughs> you going, going. Do it again, do it again. Yeah, there we go. There we go. He sounds like he has an equal length bed pipe. Hey, we're going. Oh my god, slow down. You're going too fast. All right, here we go. General admission. Let's pay $110 for two of us. I think we might have found a spot. Oh no, yeah. chance. What are you talking about? 
No chance. What is that? Open your door. Open your door. Get the f out of here. No chance. No chance. <laughs> no chance. No chance, John. Apparently that uh, F40 like crashed today. Right now. Dude, no, this is like the best part of the, like, all the video games, oh, dude. This this car this entire trip <laughs> so like the hood is really clean but the entire car is just destroyed in bugs and we're driving home tomorrow and that's just gonna make the car even more dirty so I'm not gonna wash it until we're back I am so relieved that we sold the great car now I don't know if a lot of you guys are happy I had two M4s or not I doubt it but not having that car has opened up my finances so much I was paying $650 a month on that thing. $100 of that was insurance, was interest. Another 550 bucks was the actual payment of the car. And then I was also paying another $105 in insurance. So that's like, let's just say $860 a month going to that car. And now we have zero payments, zero. So that's another 850 bucks going back into the bank account, which is super nice. So now we just have two completely paid off, bad ass cars, no loans. I am so relieved. Hopefully the new owner enjoys the car just as much as we did for the short time we had it. Now what's next? Do we save all the money that we're making now and just do mods to the two cars or do we start shopping for a third car and get that for winter? I think we should try and make it through winter with just a beater car and the two rear wheel drive cars, see what happens and then go from there. But that's just me. Because it would be super sick to get a rebuilt car, maybe an R8 in like two years after we save up enough money and do that. But there's a lot of stuff that we could do, but I think it's gonna be the end of the video. We'll see you guys back home. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. And if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button and the bell. And I'll see you next time. Drive safe. All right, let's see how many door dings my M4 has. <laughs> we good. What? We good. We we good. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Open the f***ing car, Jake. <laughs>